If you see the 403 forbidden error in Safari on your iPhone, no need to panic. This error typically means that you do not have permission to access the requested resource or there are issues with your network or website settings. But you can easily get past this problem if you try a few troubleshooting steps. So let's learn about them. Now before you follow any other process, make sure that the URL you entered is correct and double check for any typos or errors in the address. If these are not the case, then try following these steps to resolve your issue. Solution 1. Clear Safari Cache and Data Go to your phone's settings and then scroll down, then tap on Apps. Now look for Safari and once you find Safari from here, just tap on it. Now scroll down and tap on Clear History and Website Data and confirm the action by tapping on Clear History. And after that, you can scroll down and tap on Advanced. Then tap on Website Data and tap on remove all website data and hit remove now. This will remove all your website data and cache of the browser and hopefully fix the glitches. But if not, then try solution two, which will be checking for your internet connection. Swipe down to open your iPhone's control panel and see if you are connected with Wi-Fi or mobile data. And if Wi-Fi is not functioning properly, you can switch to wi mobile data and see if that works or not. And you can go back to Wi-Fi after that and see if that fixed your problem. Basically switch between Wi-Fi and mobile data. And if that did not fix your problem, then toggle on airplane mode for about 10 to 20 seconds. And after that time has passed, toggle off airplane mode. This will refresh your network settings and fix many glitches. So see if that fixed your problem or not. And after that, you can also go to other apps like YouTube or FaceTime or other apps that require your internet connection. If internet connection is working on those apps, for example, if internet is working on Facebook, that means the problem is with your browser. But if internet is not working there either, that means the problem is with your connection and you will need to contact your service provider for help. Solution three, disable VPN or proxy. For this, you have to open your phone settings, then tap on general. And you have to scroll down and tap on VPN and device management. Then if you see any VPN being turned on from here, simply disable those VPN. And after disabling the VPN, see if that fixed your issue or not. Because VPN can sometimes block website access or certain settings. So make sure to disable it and see if that fixed your problem or not. But if that did not fix your problem either, then try solution 5, which will be updating your iOS. For this, you have to go to your phone settings and then tap on general. And then tap on software update. And ensure that your iOS is updated to the latest version. If you find any updates like this, simply tap on update now and update your phone to the latest version. After updating your iPhone, your problem should be fixed for good and the 403 forbidden error should be missing as well. And you can use Safari normally again. So guys, I hope you found this video helpful. And if you want more Safari related solutions, be sure to subscribe to this channel. Thanks a lot for watching.